So hello, we are Big Game, we are a design studio from Switzerland and uh, this year at uh, Salone del Mobile we are showing a few new products, uh, some of them for Magis. Um, it's a chair for kids and a table for kids called Little Big Chair and Little Big Tables and there are also mirrors to go with it. We also have uh, some new items for Karimoku New Standard which is a Japanese company and then uh, outside of the Salone we also have some products with Tectona uh, for outdoor furniture. And we, we also have a, a set of cutlery which is presented in the showroom uh, of Alessi in town. So quality, innovation and sustainability, right? Okay. So, um, <clears throat> well, the thing is uh, that what's interesting to see at the, at the Fiera is that the whole world is coming together to, to see furniture and design at large. And there are so many brands competing that um, it's a very, very high level of, uh, of uh, performance. And the way brands can actually make a difference is by being, uh, it's true, more sustainable, uh, have a better quality and uh, overall be more responsible and sustainable. And in a way, uh, what we've seen in the recent years is that you would see a lot of projects that would sell themselves as being sustainable, as a sort of justification, but now it's more like every project has to be sustainable. There's no other way around it. It's the future. So now it's just a question of how more sustainable can you be and can you find new solutions to do that. Responsibility is of course very important as a designer because, um, because it's not a job like any other job because you're actually creating something that other people are going to use. In our case, for instance, it's really important that you always think about um, for Magis, for instance, if it's an object for kids, you have to really think about the, how the kids are going to use the product. So it has to pass all the norms and also you have to think about all the different contexts in which uh, kids can use that project. That item for instance uh, if it's in a school in a kindergarten or at home and also even though it's a chair for kids for instance it has to be strong enough that if an adult uh, is going to use it he's not going to break it so you have to take into consideration a lot of different uh, parameters and that all goes into the responsibility of a designer and also as a designer it's your responsibility to do something that people are not going to throw away but they're going to want to keep in the long run because they like it and that's the most sustainable thing you can do actually then yes uh, creativity is probably one of the key word of uh, the work of a designer and for us the creativity uh, comes directly from the daily life and we try to solve problem every day and uh, when we solve a problem even in the kitchen in the bathroom uh, in the street uh, everywhere we we it, it's a it's a kind of creativity and uh, then our main uh, influence is the daily life for for us the salon is um, is really important because it's uh, where everything start for for us we uh, we for the, we exhibited the first time here 15 years ago in the Salon des Satellites. Uh, we were invited by Marva Griffin, which is a, a really powerful woman. She, she did a lot for us. And uh, for us, uh, yeah, the Salon means the beginning of, uh, of our career. And, uh, and, uh, and, and yeah, every, every year the, the, the Salon continue to, to impress us and to, to continue to, to follow our career. So.